the global hammerhead shark population continues to nosedive mainly because of overfishing. But one nonprofit is working to halt that decline. They're hoping to protect them from extinction. Evan Narani talked with the Center for Biological Diversity in this week's Earth 8 report. Those who spend time along the San Diego coast know how intimately connected we are with our nature, especially marine life. But over the last 70 years, the global population of the great hammerhead shark has declined by more than 80 percent. So historically, the primary driver towards extinction for the great hammerhead shark has been uh, over exploitation. So that the shark species is targeted for its fins. Um, it's one of the because of the size of the fins are very large. They have a, something called a high needle count, which makes them very prized for shark fin soup. That's Kristen Cardin, the senior scientist for the Oceans Program at the Center for Biological Diversity. It's the nonprofit now launching the petition to the Secretary of Commerce and NOAA to protect the great hammerhead shark under the Endangered Species Act. Right now we're in a global extinction crisis um, and protecting species like great hammerheads is really critical uh, to protect the wealth of biodiversity that we have on this planet. Adding the great hammerhead to the list would allow for protections in U.S. waters, hopefully enough to halt the decline of the population, giving it time to recover. Protection under the Endangered Species Act, it also has some international benefits. So listing can provide financial support, law enforcement support, um, and institutional support for other countries where the great hammerhead roams that will allow it to be protected there as well. And not only has overfishing decimated the population, but when factors like climate change, pollution, and inadequate legal protection are added on, it makes for a grim outlook for the shark's future. Another way of looking at it is that we are privileged to live on a planet that has this really rich biodiversity, and if we lose it, um, we're losing something bigger. We're losing something you know, that's, part, that's, that's part of the magic of the world that we live in. Government agencies now have the opportunity to step in as urged in the petition, giving the sharks a better chance at survival. I'm Evan Narani, CBS 8.